Let me introduce myself. That's right, I'm the piano at the New York Waterway Ferry Terminal on 39th Street. How did I get here? Well, to answer that question, first I'd have to take you back to my home in Goshen, New York. You may know Goshen, it's famous for being the birthplace of harness racing. They have a trotting horse museum on Main Street. It's also the capital of Orange County. And Willie the Lion Smith, the famous jazz pianist, was born there. It's also known as the land of milk and honey, and there are many kind and generous people who live there. Anyway, it was 2015 when the mayor of the village had an inspired idea to make music and the arts more accessible to everyone. He called the project the Keys of Goshen. He asked a few generous residents to donate their pianos and artists from the local art league painted each one of us with beautiful, fantastic scenes. People came from far and wide to see and play us. I loved being played by all the people. And after a wonderful summer in the village, we were all auctioned, and I was over the moon with excitement when I found out that my buyer wanted to gift me to someone who would make it possible for even more people to see and play me, the founder of the New York Waterway Ferry Terminal. I enjoy music, I enjoy uh, opera, and uh, it just makes life more pleasant, you know? Even if people don't understand good music, when they hear it, they've got to be touched by it, you know? They've got to be moved by it. And that's what it's all about, just making people's mood a little lighter, their burdens of the day a little softer. It reaches people and it brings people together. My piano here, the I think the only thing that I put any marks to line up before I started was the the face of the Buddha. Other than that, I opened the paint and I started on one end and I worked my way around, letting it become what it became all by itself, pretty much. One of my favorite uh, Pink Floyd quotes from one of their songs to put on the inside, and so many people ask me about, well, isn't that kind of a little bit morbid? And it, if you knew the song, it, it, it's not. It's, at least I have my piano, is what he's trying to get across. Is that the whole world could fade away, but as long as I have my piano, I'll be okay. It was actually very hard to let this go. Not many people would let go of a baby grand, and it was very difficult, but I knew it was the right decision. My depth of what I have learned over the years from my family uh, has intuitively brought me into an area where I can enhance the quality of that particular sound, which thus is its own personality. This is a unique program. Uh, usually a Keys program like this is relegated to a Manhattan or to a Denver, Colorado, or to a Boston, Massachusetts. Here's a little tiny Goshen, um, and we've got our own piano program three years in the making. Hopefully this piano will bring more attention to that and draw people up to Goshen to see not just our pianos, but what we're all about, because we're pretty proud of our community. The idea that we could take a piece of art that you would normally see on a flat surface and make it dimensional, and then have music coming out of it, it was just, it was magical to me. The community level is bringing art right out to the street, right out to people, letting people touch the art, letting people feel that the art is a part of them, that it belongs to them. We can be an accidental witness to something really uh, quite amazing. I think it can spark something in them that they, at that moment that they may not have even realized was, was in them. The pianos have led to people being more present, more in the moment. And in the hustle bustle of the world around us, there's always distractions, but people would be walking down the street, they would stop and listen. You have people that haven't played piano for 20, 30, 50 years who start playing again because it's right there, it's on Main Street, it's exciting, it's beautiful. So it really has led to an increase in community engagement. And that's really made Goshen a community that's known for arts and music. It changes the environment. You know, there's people that go through their day and then they come through this terminal and they hear the music and it changes their whole mood. All of a sudden, it's not so bad. And this kindness, I hope, continues to infect the world. So we're here celebrating life. We give the piano a happy home. It's amazing how one kind action can inspire 
so much more kindness.